Okay, so hello and welcome to our Hall of Fame interview of Macrame Artist Hub. Today we have a very special community member and she's here to share her macrame business journey with us today. So let me introduce to you Akshita. We have Akshita Shah over here and let me give you a little um, background about her. She's a singer, she's a dancer, she's a cyclist, she's a plant lover. She's a mother to an amazing 12-year-old boy. She was also a French tutor for eight years and now she's a macrame artist and she has a very own macrame business also. She's been a part of our community macrame artist hub since the past one year. So let's welcome Akshita and let's hear her journey from her and let's hear uh, let's hear all about it now. Okay, so super Akshita. So hi Akshita, hello. Hello, hi. Amazing. So, uh, Akshita, please tell us that how was your life before you joined Macrame Artist Hub? Like, what was your journey before you started Macrame, uh, Macrame and Ma joined Macrame Artist Hub? So, Asnehi, uh, life has always been good, honestly. Um, like, you know, but of course, I was juggling between so many things, as I have uh, already told you, like, you know, being a mother. I mean, motherhood is a full time profession. And um, so, I've been doing things that I always used to like doing. Uh, but then came this. Uh, silver membership you know then I just came across you um, through Instagram and uh, I think I was just you know thinking of uh, starting something of my own something that I like doing and um, I'm sure Google just you know uh, showed me you and I could not resist but join you so since then everything has like you know there's a 360 degree uh, turn in my life so um, of course there has always been good but now things are going better and best, I can say. So, um, yeah, things are really working nice for me. All thanks to you. Yeah. Amazing, amazing. Super. So, then we would love to know that um, how has your journey been till now? And, like, what are the three things that shifted inside you when you joined the Macrame Artist Hub? Like, how did you start your business? How did you start getting orders? Like, we'd just love to know a little bit more about that also. So, uh, honestly, the first thing that, you know, uh, you have been such a good coach. Um, like, the way you teach is superb. So I think uh, gratitude is always there, but you keep on mentioning, you know, always that just show a little more gratitude, kindness, whatever. So I'm sure after doing this um, silver membership, you know, the first thing that I would say that has really like, you know, that the change in me is I started uh, feeling that gratitude for everything that I have in life. Second, I would, I would say, um, as you say, fail fast. So I think now, you know, I am not getting affected by any kind of failure. I mean, not those major failures, of course, uh, but I just don't uh, get affected by any failures because I know that I have to fail fast just in case if, I'm, if things are not working, I just have to move ahead, you know. And uh, so, and that is adding on to the third point that, you know, I keep gaining confidence because I know if I cannot, it is okay. And uh, I used to, you know, hold on to things earlier. Uh, I don't know how will I be able to do or no. And then probably that used to, uh, I used to feel that I can just, I, have, I should give up on certain things which no more come to me now. So I feel a little more confident. And I think life now feels a little more worth living. You know, I feel good about myself. So things are really nice. So orders also, of course, um, uh, through Instagram, the first thing that um, was uh, because of friends and family, I've got a huge uh, social circle. But uh, slowly and gradually now, I feel uh, via Instagram also, I am getting good orders. I like doing things and I'm just... Macrame is keeping me busy. Yeah, that's amazing, amazing. So would you mind sharing that? Um, how much revenue have you generated from your macrame business already till now? Like what's a rough figure that you've- uh, Now, it's yeah. been uh, a year and a half, I can say, uh, yes. that I have, you know, I had this typical page of mine and this uh, with the orders and everything. So I think um, initially I was really uh, bad with uh, jotting down things, you know, now with your coaching. I've started that. So I would not really count those six earlier, like no earlier six months. Um, yeah. But I think now I have reached somewhere around uh, 160,000 probably. Yes, uh, okay. maybe more than that because I have really not yeah. got down. But right. um, yeah, it is, it is good. Um, awesome awesome so whoever's hearing till now just write a woohoo in the chat box for uh, Akshita at the bottom just comment so that we all can congratulate her and be happy together that yes she's made a huge progress since she started her journey and uh, how has macrame been for you like has it been easy was it difficult how did you catch up like if you just like to share that was it easy to learn macrame and start a business? How, how was that part of it? So, yeah. uh, for me, actually, I knew this art because I was a textile background student, you know. Yes. Mama had taught me like years back 
Well, that time we used to do with Sutli and you know things like that. So uh, I think the only mentor I could get was you. And like you know what was there in the market right now? I had learned it like almost twenty five years yeah. back, twenty five thirty years back. So uh, you really made a point um, to solve all the doubts or whatever. So it was all like you know I can say I was always there here somewhere because I knew a little bit. But then still I have to reach of course those heights. But you have really given that push you know by teaching. And uh, the whole process of the silver membership has really been good because none of our doubts are honestly unanswered, you know. So we keep uh, getting all the answers. And of course, see, nobody can master this art in like a day. So you yeah. have to keep on practicing, of course. And just if uh, you're not giving up on anything and work on your uh, finesse and, you know, the way, I think uh, you have anyways made it easy. Yeah. <laughs> amazing super so you also mentioned you're a mother of a 12 year old boy so how is how is the business part juggling with a uh, personal life like how what's the balance been like for you for I, I think uh, uh Snehi, because of him i have really i mean the half of the revenue that i can say is because of him uh <laughs> last year in the march uh, april vacation actually yes. uh i also loved teaching i was a, i was a french tutor earlier yes so um i uh just walking on your path, of course, not teaching the adults, but the children. I think I taught 47 or 48 odd children. Wow. Of class and all. So, and they, you know, still, till they, they just come to me. Uh, so, of course, they, they want to make those smaller things, you know, for friendship, they, or whatever, whatever comes. Yes. So, uh, I would, in fact, thank him because of him. I think, you know, I'm more into teaching. And then um, he also loves um, doing these things with me now. And um, he's my partner in crime, I think. Yeah. Wow, that's amazing. That's very sweet. Because that's like one of the most challenging parts, right? But one, you know, actually, I chose, I was actually looking for a business. I mean, of course, a business that I could do uh, because I knew I had to take care of, like, you know, my son, my in laws stay in my native place. So, of course, there is no, um, they are always helpful, but they are not here. So, of course, I have to see juggle between the house and work. So, I think nothing better than macrame, you know, because this is something that I can really, in this, a room there's like the my the whole house is workshop actually but you know i can just yeah uh, if, if anything is there i'm always at home i know that so you know i can just keep on shuffling between work there is nothing like you know that i'm working as an office hour that i have to be here and whatever and because i know i have some responsibilities i always accept orders and i let my clients know that you know i may take a little i mean probably a week or 10 days according to whatever i have to make so i think uh, it i can manage it really well that that's the beauty about having a business and running it from the comfort of your home, right? Not having to go to office as such. Awesome, amazing, super. Uh, one last question: That what would be your one golden nugget for other macrame artists who want to start their own business? Like, what would you give one golden tip from your side? That this is a swan by tip that this will work for you. Any any one golden nugget you can give? From so I think uh, I don't know about the business, but uh, as a woman, you know, I feel. You just unleash your hidden talent. I feel uh, just go for it. Try it once. Uh, you know, you always have that uh, uh, self. You know, you always keep judging yourself that I may not be able to do this or that. So I think just keep that away. Just start it once. You may have that uh, thing, you know, earlier that Ye mujhse nahi ho I will not be able to do this. But never know. You may just master it in like, you know, in like no time. So I think just that keep all the fears away and give it a try. Amazing. I mean, that'll be super encouraging for lots many women who are uh, maybe thinking that that'll be that'll be really helpful for them. Amazing. Yes. Super, super. So thank you so much for sharing uh, all the tips and tricks and your journey with us today. And for everyone who's watching, I would love to tell you that Akshita has her own Instagram page. It's called The Little Knots. I will be leaving a um, link for on of her page under this um, video. So do check that out. You can go follow her. If you like her stuff, you can even order from her. She's running a business. So go for it. Do check her page out. And like Akshita, if you also wish to start a macrame business right from the comfort of your home, you can join and come for my free masterclass where I'll be sharing three secrets on how you can start your macrame business and you can start generating income. Okay. So if whoever's watching over here, you want to join in for the free masterclass, the link is also under sign up, register now and I will see you over there. And for everyone who wants to hear more inspiring stories like that, you want to hear more Hall of Fame interviews, don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel, hit the like button and share this video with as many women as possible so they all can spread their wings and start their journey. So, so I, think so I just want to really shout out to me that there is 
hidden in the forest so you must do this i feel you know uh, while they do something the ones who deal in shares and all there's always an asterisk saying some yeah. line which goes really so far that people cannot understand so right. please people snehi is somebody who is a great storyteller and uh, i think in no time she would just make you like you know fall in love with macrame so you must try super super thank you so much for coming thank, thank you so much for giving your time here today and i will see you soon yeah thank you see you thank you bye bye